Welcome back to Sam's Watch Review, a place for everything about budget watches. About a month ago, I posted a video showing how my F91W had better accuracy than my DW5600 and Scheme 1628. The F91W only slipped under 1 second in a month, which is very incredible. Some of you responded in the comments asking if all F91W watches have that kind of accuracy. Well, today we are diving deeper into this topic and I only have one F91W unit but there are other watches with the same module, the 593 like the A158 and also A159. I also have several other watches with similar modules so I thought it would be a good idea to conduct an accuracy check on these watches. And here is a video from August the 2nd where I set up the F91W, A158 and A159. I also set up the F94W, F105W, A168W, W59, and the Slim A700. And to be honest, the synchronization wasn't 100% accurate since it was done manually. Later that evening, I also added two more watches to the test, the Scheme 1123 and the Scheme 1412, which are models that copy the F91W series. After one month, here is how these watches compared to an atomic clock. The F91W still had a time difference of under 1 second, which roughly translates to about 10 seconds per year, and that's very impressive. The A158, which has the same module as the F91W, was about 9 to 10 seconds behind. This means it would be just under 2 minutes per year. And then the A159, also the same module, was about 7 to 8 seconds fast, roughly equating to 1.5 minutes per year. And then the F94W, which has a similar module but a different LCD layout, was 3 to 4 seconds behind, translating to roughly about 40 seconds per year. And then the F105W, with the module 3298 and an improved EL backlight, was about 4 seconds fast, meaning it would be about 48 seconds off per year. And then the A168, which has the same module as the F105W, it was behind by about 12 seconds, or roughly almost two and a half minutes annually. And then the W59, with module code 590, was under two seconds behind, translating to about 20 seconds per year. And then the Slim A700, which was under one second behind, which also roughly means about 10 seconds per year, Another impressive performance. Moving on to the watches that copied the F91W series, the Scheme 1123, it was 16 seconds fast, equating to about 3 minutes and 12 seconds per year. And then lastly, the Scheme 1412 was slightly more than 30 seconds fast per month, meaning it would be off by more than 6 minutes per year. So the top performers in this accuracy test were the F91W, W59, and A700, all with no more than a 3 second difference per month. On the other hand, the A168, Scheme 1123, and Scheme 1412 showed less impressive accuracy, with the Scheme 1412 being more than half a minute off per month. Interestingly, the three watches with the 593 module, the F91W, A158, and A159, had varying results, but still maintained less than a 10 second difference per month, although either slower or faster. The same consistency was also seen in the F94W, F105W, W59, and also A700 models. I'm not entirely sure why the A168 results differs from the others. If you have any ideas why, please share them in the comments below. And that's all for today's accuracy test. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to click like and subscribe for more budget watch reviews. Have a great day.